Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Ultimate speed, slippery slopes, endless vortex. Some of these water slides have left the roller coasters behind in terms of danger. And in today's video, we will talk about the slides that should be shut down forever. King Cobra Water Slide. Imagine sliding down by the fangs of a King Cobra. Situated at the Six Flags Hurricane Harbor in Jackson, New Jersey, this slide had everything one can wish for. Vibrant visuals, check. Sliding monstrous slide, check. Cool fangs, check. King Cobra was marketed as the first ride of its kind in the United States when the water ride opened back in July 2012. King Cobra had orange, bold, black, and red scales to resemble a massive cobra on both the interior and exterior of the slide. King Cobra featured two dueling slides. Unfortunately, the slide had to be dismantled in 2018 due to various reported accidents. In 2015, a woman was injured while riding because she had exceeded the 200-pound weight limit for single riders and got slammed into the mouth of the snake. Cheetah Chase Roller coasters are all cool and stuff, but there's a new coaster in town that's gonna give all the other coasters a run for their money. In 2020, the Holiday World and Splash and Safari theme and water park in Indiana debuted the Cheetah Chase, which is said to be the world's first water coaster. The water slide reaches a top speed of 20 miles per hour. To ride this cool coaster, you don't have to walk up a flight of stairs or get on a conveyor. Rather, the riders had to leave the station down a very short hill, and then, solely through the power of water, they'll be launched uphill. Some injuries are reported now and then. Recently, a woman was hospitalized with a severe back injury after riding the coaster. Aquaconda Want to go on a six-seater raft adventure with your family? At the length of 690 feet, Aquaconda is the world's largest six-person water slide tube. This serpentine water slide ride takes you by surprise through the various twists and turns through its curves, its tight corners, and 30-foot wide section that sends the riders flying up to the sides of the slide. The giant serpentine ride allows the riders to experience the dark twisting tunnels by swallowing you down the fiberglass tube. If you won't hold tightly or won't adhere to the weight limit, the ride can most likely turn into a fatal accident. Tornado Water Ride Situated at the Six Flags Hurricane Water Park, the tornado requires riders to sit in a two to six seater round two. Riders oscillate from one side to the other until they exit through the back of the funnel into a splash pool. First, you'll shoot from a height of 75 feet down a 132-foot tunnel. You will be rushing through with more than 5,000 gallons of water, so the action will be pretty fast and intense. A couple even sued the water park over their safety regulations after getting a severe and permanent bodily injury when a flotation device overturned during a ride through the tornado at Six Flags Hurricane Harbor Water Park. This wasn't the only time, as while riding the raft, one person slipped out and floated inside the tornado, as you can see in this video. Steamer Water Slide The Steamer Water Slide from the Calypso Water Park is one of the most notorious slides due to numerous reports of injuries. The fact that the park is not only operating a water slide that has proven itself dangerous on a number of occasions, but they're also pretending like it isn't dangerous so people will continue to ride it. In one incident, the tube went down backward in the final tunnel until a gush of water caught the tube and flipped a couple in the tunnel. The woman broke her collarbone, and her husband, on the other hand, got a mild concussion and suffered bruised shoulders for a week. 
Ultimately, the park was hit with 20 safety violation charges, but it is still not closed. Tornado Water Slide Tornado Water Slide, which is nicknamed the Tantrum Alley, is located at Wild Wadi Water Park in Dubai. It is a four-person family ride, containing two sections of downhill tube slides and three exciting tornadoes. It's a whole 37 seconds of surprising experiences, where the riders will first enter the high-speed downhill, followed by a back-and-forth slide from the first tornado, and then finally lends into the splash of the pool after circling around through the second and third tornado. Not a ride for you if you don't want to end up nauseated. Let's take a look here. <laughs> Damn water slide. Illegal versus fun. Whose side are you on? This giant damn water slide in Australia looks too fun to be legal. However, due to the serious risk factors attached with the flip bucket at the bottom, the Shire Council's manager of water had the restraint to give permission. As with any significant flow, you can be held underwater in the flip bucket and drowned. Being labeled with bad idea? Check its huge slipway. Rotating Water Slide This rotating water slide at Aqua Park will make you feel there is no gravity. Rotating three times per minute while you sit on a raft holding up to four people, it's like a cross between a water slide and a Ferris wheel. Nearly 90 feet high structure is visible from a long distance, since it is much higher than the building of Aqua Park. Unlike any other water slides, where you go straight down or in winding loops, guests on the aqua spinner go back and forth in a pendulum motion thanks to the way the top part of the slide continuously rotates. This happens several times before you complete the loop and finish the slide in a smooth ride. People with claustrophobia and a tendency to puke on dizzy rides are told to stay away. U-shaped water slide. The Wild Water Adventure Park in Clovis, Canada has this giant water slide that will keep you swinging side by side until you come to the end. While it is constructed with safety and quality to meet and exceed the rider's expectations, it looks like a weird combo of fun and scariness. It's built on a wide U-shaped structure where riders move like an actual pendulum somewhere between the open sky and tropical green trees. Would you try this? Here we go. <laughs> and now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is a picture of the crazy toilet water slide in Germany. Before entering the gigantic bowl, guests plunge down a high speed and steep drop. Then they get spun for approximately four rounds until reaching the center and falling into a deep pool. As much fun as it is, the slide is only advisable to use a few times a day, as the extreme centrifugal force can damage the skin membrane. Wild Surf Water Slide Here goes the world's largest man-made wave! Well, this unusual parabolic ride is called Wild Surf. This giant slide brings a daring 40-degree sloped entrance. The whole experience starts with a long, rushing trip through the dark, which is just the right experience for all those adrenaline junkies out there. And then you enter a blanket with a 180-degree turn that will bank you up and down the slide walls. No, that whole experience is heart-pounding hang time. However, if you happen to slip out of it, it can turn into a painful fall. Apart from falling off, there is nothing to be concerned about, and it will help you study your angles too. And if everything goes right, 
you will just be drenched by a water shower spilling from the lip of the wave. They slide from side to side, forwards and backwards, before finally splashing into the exit. Barracuda Blaster If you're up for dangerous, spiraling fun, then Barracuda Blaster is just the ride for you. In this slide, you will travel in a tube at high speed. Then you'll be twisted round and round on the steep banks of a massive whirling bowl of water until you're flushed out. Riders will experience high speeds and rapid movements from side to side, but it may appear amusing from a distance. Only those who have been there can tell you how fast it is, and all the spinning may make your heart race. So this trip is not for weak-hearted people. The maximum weight on the slide is 250 pounds, obviously for safety reasons. And just so you know, there is nothing to hold onto the tube, and falling out of it will hurt really, really bad. That's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video till the end. See you next time.